So, excuse the gorilla videos, y'all. Welcome back to Cigar Ralphie. Hope you can hear me over all this wind. But I'm smoking the Gao, Chao, Gao, Gao. I imagine that's how you say it, Gao Brasilia. I've never smoked a, one of these Gao cigars. They're Brazilian. Um, they're a Nicaraguan rapper. Now, my uh, my cigar guy at my cigar shop over here, where I normally get my uh, my cigars from, told me, he asked me, every time I go in, he, you know, he'll come in, he'll like, hey, you looking for anything, what's going on, you know, we conversate. He asked me, you looking for anything in particular, you want something strong, you want something, you know. I always get like, if I see something new I've never smoked, I normally get that. I'll get one or two of my regulars, you know, three or four, whatever, the ones that I normally get, some that I really like. And, you know, I try to maintain a budget, try. I usually spend 98 bucks every time I go in there. It's like once or twice, you know, a month. But he said, you want something strong? I said, well, if I'm trying something new, let me try it strong, you know? So he gave me one of these. Gao Brasilia. Never had it before. Um, Feito a mao means hecho a mano, which means made by hand. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this up. And again, I'm sorry about the handheld, the guerrilla, guerrilla warfare here, the guerrilla filmmaking that's happening right now. You know, I'm over here. I'm over here in front of the lake, so, you know, filming with my phone, and I didn't bring my tripod, so, let's go ahead and like this stuff. So, the cold drawer. Cold drawer. It's got like a... It's real spicy, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is spicy, this one, I can feel it right on the back of my throat, my tongue, it's spicy. Like, not not horrible, like, oh my God, I hate this. Like, no, this is, it's it's a good spice, like good spicy, good spiciness to it. Uh, real earthy, how they say, real earthy, earthy, earthy taste. <laughs> I, don't, I don't even know what that is, I, I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't even know what earthy is. I, I'm imagining what it is. I mean, I can imagine it's like licking the ground or something right here, but I don't know. But I mean, no, it's not like that. It's not like licking the ground, but it's good. It's good, man. It's yeah. There's like there's like a not a mint, not a mint, not a mint, but it's like something close to it. You know what I'm saying? Something. Oh man, it's not bad. This is a—it's really. This is a big boy. Mmm, damn. Oh, let me show you. Let me show you. Let me show you. Let me show you. Thing I always talk about. The cheese. This is now. Uh, this is you know tropical. This isn't like right from the motherland. It's some big company, a Spanish company still, you know, but a Hispanic company. But it's the same cheese, you know, they make it typical. It's a crumbling cheese. And what do you, why am I showing you this, you're asking? Because remember I talk about how I like to eat the cheese and smoke. I'll tell you why. I don't know what it is about this cheese normally made for salads, you know, excuse me if I got some on my teeth, salty, and the saltiness that it leaves in my mouth with the flavors of the cigar, like the the peppery flavors and that earthy flavor and, and whatever flavors that it has, and it, it usually works for most cigars, not the sweet ones, not like the coffee infused, not the... Not and, and I said it and I caught myself. I made a mistake if you heard that video before where I said it. I normally eat this with no cafe. Um, I could drink it with the coffee, I could eat the cheese, drink the coffee, and smoke a cigar. But with the nub cafe, the certain nub cafe that I didn't go good, it wasn't the best with. 
you know, but with this, damn, that taste. See, okay, let me tell you what this does. Oh, here comes my duck. Look at my duck. Come here, big guy. I got nothing. I got no bread for you today. Look, he just walks through. All right, there. I'm just walking away from your ass. <laughs> but the flavor that it leaves, I guess because of the. <clears throat> this doesn't have like a high sweet flavor. This has, you know, that salty. I told you I don't got no bread. Um, you know that salt. I mean, sorry, that 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 peppery flavor. That salt and pepper, I guess, go good together. So when I drink, when I eat that cheese and I smoke, it's like I don't know. It's like they're marrying in there, you know. This is beautiful. I smoked this bad boy down and I gotta say it's getting better and better the more I smoke it down I haven't met a quality cigar yet that has let me down really bad it's actually really good really good really good um, my first one and look I mean look how that ash is holding up I mean it's not that not that long I, I, I still haven't spilled any ash that's quality right there. Really good stick. I can imagine when I get to that. I can imagine I'm not to the sweet spot yet, but I know I'm getting there. But it's really good. It's holding up well. The the flavors are coming out more. I'm looking at the packing of this thing. It looks pretty tight, but it's got a good draw. So I mean, if you're in the market for this, if you like Brazilian cigars or if there's any more, I'm sure there's more from this brand, from this company here. I know there is, not I'm sure, I know there is. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna try them out little by little. I got a bunch of cigars up there. You know, I got a bunch of Cohiba, so I'm not gonna do a Cohiba review in a while unless I'm talking about some other craziness. But all the other ones I have, I'm gonna review them. I was gonna do a Gurkha. One of the latest, the latest Gurkha that came out. I got three different kinds of the latest one. that They dropped three, I believe, recently. Uh, well, according to my cigar, my my local cigar shop. They dropped three and I bought three of them. One of my ducks are... Look at these guys, look at these guys. Oh, they're fighting. He flew all the way from the other side of the Dagon Lake. From over there. All the way over here, just to fight gangster it's gangster over here it's real over here but anyway you guys know what to do man don't forget to like and subscribe follow me on social media and i'll see you on the next Sweet.